facts and new tonight, the Tennessee Department of Health makes a major announcement. The state received shipments of the Merck and Pfizer COVID-19 pills seen right here on your screen. That could soon be in your reach. Not only that, company officials with Walmart and Sam's Club say the pills will be dispensed at select pharmacy locations of their stores. Gerald Harris has more on the latest tool in the tool belt of Tennesseans that could help ease the burden on those hospitals. It feels like a step forward in the pandemic that's often felt like a revolving door. Transitioning into the Omicron variant, it is here and it's here in a big way. The Food and Drug Administration issued an emergency use authorization for COVID treatment pills from two pharmaceutical companies, Merck and Pfizer. That unvaccinated individuals are still at the highest risk, uh, even if this is a milder variant. However, the larger news is it's finally available at retail stores like Walmart and Sam's Club for people infected with COVID and with a prescription. When you have a lot of unvaccinated people and a very highly transmissible variant, you're still going to have some individuals with very severe disease. And it comes as COVID cases are surging with plenty of community spread. Both drugs, Paxlovid and Molnupiravir, both target the virus as it tries to copy itself inside the cell. According to the Tennessee Department of Health, early studies indicate these treatment options may reduce severe outcomes from COVID-19, including hospitalization or death. These treatments are recommended for individuals who are at high risk for progression to severe COVID-19 or have underlying medical conditions. The state was given an initial total supply of 6,000 courses from the federal government. Everybody should get the vaccine, should get the boosters. That is shown to really prevent severe disease. And then those people who would be at the highest risk for severe disease, um, the elderly, those who are immunocompromised, those who for some reason can't get vaccine, either very young or very old or other reasons, then we have another tool waiting to help us. In Asheville, I'm Gerald Harris. Health leaders say the antiviral drug may help treat COVID, but it is not a substitute for getting that COVID-19 vaccine. Tennesseans ages five years and older are eligible for that shot.